Jace Talis. No great science should ever put lives in danger. Be honest now, what manner of inquiry was this? You are accused of illegal experimentation and endangering the citizens of Piltover. What do you have to say for yourself? Professor Heimerdinger, I... I believe I've discovered something truly incredible. A way to harness magic through science. Magic? Do you have anything to show for your work besides an explosion? Uh, no. It came to nothing. So you're saying your study was meaningless? It was revolutionary. Revolutionary how? All I see is a boy meddling with things he doesn't understand. Admit your work was dangerous, but speak nothing of magic. If we condone this, what's next? Ridiculous, really. The Council has more in Why is the Academy <laughs> This is... Perhaps this we is... should just finish... I was trying time. to create magic. Magic saved your life. Yes. But it won't save yours now. You need to let it go. Am I in the thing? I could have convinced the council. If my own family won't help me, I'll find someone who will. I saw with my own eyes what magic can do. Lives it can save. You've no idea how beautiful it is. And now it's gone. No one believed me. Jay? Jay? I want to help you complete your research. My dad says you're a misfit. I'm sorry. I just wanted to explain. I think you've done enough. Scientists seek discoveries, ways to make the world a better place. This Hextech dream of yours has the potential to do that. Piltover needs a leader who looks forward. Someone like you. I propose that a new chair be brought forth and that House Talus be elevated to this august body. What? Give the people a glimpse of the future. I never wanted anything to do with politics. You pushed this on me. What will you do? You're a symbol of the future now, Jace, whether you like it or not. With that comes the potential to shape your own destiny. The Council assumes you'll fail. Time to prove them all wrong. Once again. Soon we can do it. Soon? There are people who need our help now, Jace. You've actually done it. We need a leadership focused on the future. Not the past. I believe it's time we gave the beloved founder of our city a well-deserved retirement. Jace, don't do this. He was my mentor, Mel. And I betrayed him. You want us to build weapons? We would shatter any attempt at peace. The peace is already broken, Jace. I'm only asking you to prepare to defend your people. We need to act. We're scientists, not soldiers. We may not have a choice. You said you were tired of doing nothing. There is always a choice. I'm not a vigilante. No, you're a victim. I'm worried I have to do something I never thought I would. Do you not understand? I am part of this now. You've always been a part of this. You just never had to look it in the eye. One dead kid? There's hundreds more where he came from, thanks to Silco and thanks to people like you who stuck their heads in the dirt. You're the first person Caitlin looked for when we made it to Topside. You're the one she trusted. Am I interrupting? I'm not fit to govern the people who live there. And neither are you. You're afraid. I am afraid. Today I got a glimpse of what war between us might look like. Your people wouldn't stand a chance. Council couldn't care less. I'm trying to save you from annihilation. You're walking a fine line, Jace. With respect, I don't give a shit what any of you think of me anymore. Victor saved my life once. Now he needs me and there's nothing I can do. 
I hate feeling so useless. I support Councillor Talis's proposal for peace. We lost ourselves. Lost our dream. In the pursuit of great, we failed to do good.